this because right. they want their babysitters back. Right. And new at six, these Oakley school board members were caught bashing parents on a Zoom right. broadcast. Now the district is working to figure out how to fill their empty seats. KPIX 5's Wilson Walker live in Oakley with a meeting happening right now. Wilson? Ken, tonight's meeting can only happen because two members of the County Board of Education are temporarily filling the seats on the local board here. And for parents who are hoping that the big shakeup is going to speed up school reopenings, not so fast. Yeah, you know, unfortunately, you got to be careful what you wish for. And when when the board left, all of that board work kind of got set aside. Mike yeah, Maxwell is one of the two interim members of the Oakley School Board, and he stresses interim. The only item on their agenda tonight is figuring out how to get the board refilled with local leadership. This is the reset meeting. So this is the meeting that's going to reset everybody. Because they want their babysitters back. While right. it certainly will right. not match the outrage from last week's meeting, the procedural steps required to find a new board might lead to some more frustration for parents. We're just waiting for them to hopefully make negotiations with our district and um, give us a start date. That hope or expectation even that the board's resignation will accelerate a return to the classroom might be optimistic. The community got what they wanted. However, it, it slowed the process down a little bit. There, they had some. They had a very little bit of traction going, and now that's all gone. They, we have to. We basically have to start over. So the question tonight: Who is ready to step up and be the next Oakley School Board? Right there in the community, there are five people that are going to uh, take on these roles. They may not know who they are yet, but they are going to get. We're going to get five people from that community to take on these roles. All right, now Maxwell says he is personally supportive of getting kids back into classrooms, but he also says he cannot make that decision on his own for the local district as a temporary trustee of that seat. So if classrooms are going to reopen here in Oakley, it is going to take a new locally derived school board to make it happen, and no one is sure when that will happen. We are live here in Oakley. Wilson Walker, KPIX 5.